Hello, I'm Lincoln Arneal with Hustlers Illustrated with your recap after Nebraska defeats Arkansas 3-1 in the regional final to advance to the national semifinals next week in Tampa, Florida. It was an exciting match from the get-go. Uh, Arkansas runs a very fast, speedy offense, has a scrappy defense. The Huskers were ready for it. Devaney Center was really amped. Uh, it was just a great atmosphere to start. Arkansas actually got uh, got a little bit of advantage there in the first set, though. 21-16 lead in the first set before Nebraska flipped the switch. Uh, their block got a little more involved, too. Nebraska closes strong uh, with a 16-3, or sorry, 10-3 run uh, in that first set to win it 26-24. Uh, that, that momentum carried Nebraska into the second set. They really, their block was... Uh, just controlling the tempo, even when they weren't getting points off of it, uh, they were able to turn back Arkansas's attack. Arkansas finished the match with 180 swings. Nebraska had 155, and they only had about 16 more digs, so that's a sizable difference. Just Nebraska's blocks was turning it back, so Arkansas kept swinging, kept swinging. Uh, Nebraska's defense was just uh, raised itself another notch and, and really controlled the flow of the game, too. So second set, Nebraska ran away with it at 25-14. Nebraska was in control, but as we've seen so many times this year, the third set lull got the best of Nebraska. Again, another tight end of the third set. Uh, Arkansas gets a little bit of a lead, and they're able to finish it out this time. But fourth set, Nebraska rallies very tight. Again, Arkansas is up 20-18. to 18. Uh, There was actually a key point there, a key reversal, tied it up at 19-19. Arkansas wins the next one. So again, they're the first team to 20 points. They, that happened in three out of the four sets. Arkansas was the first team, but as Nebraska has always done uh, this entire match and a lot of times this season, uh, they closed strong. Nebraska finishes strong 25-23, uh, uh, ended with a service error, kind of anticlimactic, but at this point, it doesn't matter. Nebraska took a, took a lap around Devaney Center giving high fives. They finished the season undefeated at Devaney. Uh, what a historic season for Nebraska from the, the home schedule. I mean, they had volleyball day in Nebraska, beating Wisconsin here at the Devaney Center, and then winning the first regional here since 2016. Sends Nebraska to the Final Four next week in Tampa. Uh, Merritt Beeson does what she does. She had 19 kills, eight, eight blocks. Uh, Harper Murray stepped up big later as the match went on. She had 15 kills. Uh, and then also 12 digs as well, too. So really outstanding work from that freshman. Becca Alec wasn't that active in the, in the uh, offense, but her block came through. She had 12 stuffs. Her and Merritt Beeson uh, were a big part of that block, uh, trying to corral Arkansas's undersized hitters, and they did a great job. Like I said, even when they weren't getting points off it, they were turning it back and really forcing that, them to hit. Uh, Jillian Gillen had 57 attacks, finished with just 14 kills. Taylor Head had... Uh, 51 attacks, 10 kills, 10 errors. So Nebraska did a great job on the Arkansas attackers, really kept them in control. Uh, Bergen Riley, just an outstanding match from the freshman, 40 assists, a couple kills in there, 16 digs. So really fine over the court. And Nebraska really, when the moments were the biggest, really delivered, re regained their composure uh, after Arkansas ran off a couple points. And they're headed to the Final Four, too. It's a very special year for Nebraska. Uh, they were back there in 2021 with these group of juniors were freshmen, but Nebraska will be heading back there with a brand new slate of uh, players. A lot of freshmen making big impacts. Uh, Ali Batenhorst had nine kills. Andy Jackson had seven. Becca Alec, like I said, had five kills and uh, 12 blocks. So just a team effort, really got it done. And it's a, it's a, and a fun atmosphere here at Devaney. So reporting to you from Huskers Illustrated, I'm Lincoln Arneal. And we'll see you next week in Florida.